like it or not, your favorite guy, Tom Brady, got a 10-year deal to, to do football games as a commentator on Fox upon the conclusion of his football career, which no. may be, you know, 10, 15 years from now. Look, they, you know, they always say anytime you can give a record contract of guaranteed money to a guy that's never done a second of that job before <laughs> in the highest competitive television market, you have to do it. This is the dumbest thing I've ever heard in my life. Because, yes, you're getting a name, and everybody talked about it for the day after it happened on Twitter, right? You gotta put him in that booth. Yeah. And you know how hard it is to do games like that. Jason Winton went back and played football instead of having to go out and do another season again. Tom Brady has no personality, right? He mimics other human beings and their human emotion. He eats only avocados. He goes to bed at eight o'clock in a windowless room. By the way, I'm not making any of this up. You in can a check windowless room. Windowless room at eight in the morning, probably in a hyperbaric chamber. Here's my guarantee. This is a Pat Duffy guarantee. Two years, Brady will take himself out of that position because he can't do it, but he's going to make it sound like something else happened. Because, you know, you know how Brady is. He's always got to look like a good guy. I'm a good guy. I'm a good guy. <laughs> Greg, I think maybe for the first time in his career, he's being set up to fail. I, I, I almost agree entirely with what Pat's saying. I could not agree more with what Pat is saying. I, I, I think it's very difficult to do... To, to go into the booth. I think that to be good at it and to get a 10-year contract is a slap in the face to the guys that are doing it. The the idea of being able to relate to somebody, you know, he jokes about the avocado toast and living sleeping in a hyperbaric chamber, but that's just not the rest of us. Why is Charles Barkley so fun? Why is Shaq so fun? Yeah. Because they eat chicken wings and they fall down and they tackle each other. That's fun to watch because that's what we do when we watch sports. And I don't even have to be like that because Tony Romo and Chris Collinsworth are two of the best, really good players, but neither of them are Hall of Famers. But here's why. Because they can be self-deprecating. Tony exactly. Romo can watch a quarterback do something and go, well, if I would have, ah, same with Chris Collinsworth. Brady can't do that. Until somebody's got seven Super Bowl rings, right, has the all of the records, Brady can't do that. By the way, what's not relatable about a wheatgrass juice smoothie for breakfast every day? Get out of my face. He has always this. loved Tom Brady. I mean, think of, to this point, what, you, you don't think there's going to be just – gobs and gobs of condescension coming out of Tom's mouth every time he talks. <laughs> With the wheatgrass juice every stuck in there for breakfast. Talks. Condescension avocado well, wheatgrass no. juice. If he only tried harder, we would Different reasons, but I think we're unanimous here.